Hey guys, Dion from Dion Video Productions here, and today we're shooting the intro of the video on my roof with a beautiful background. And uh, today we're going to be looking at exporting 4K from Final Cut Pro 10. Now, if you have a 4K camera, your final product has to be exported in 4K to truly appreciate the quality. So, without further ado, let's get started. All right, guys, looking at my camera settings, as you can see, we're shooting in 4K at 24 frames per second, and this is the exact same resolution uh, that the example clip is shot in that you'll see right here on my desktop. Uh, this right here is the example clip that we'll be working with today, and as you can see, the dimensions are just, uh, well, regular 4K. So let's go ahead and get started here. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is open up Final Cut Pro 10, just like we would with any other project. And we're gonna just simply import the media. All right, and once it is finished importing to Final Cut Pro 10, we can of course view it directly in the events library if you like. But for now, let's go ahead and create a new project. Now from here, we have a few options. Uh, we can either have the video properties uh, based on the first clip, or we can custom set them ourselves. Now setting them uh, to based on first clip will automatically adjust, which will work too. We're going to go ahead and select uh, custom just to show you the different options. As you can see, it is currently set to 1080p HD. Change that to 4K and the resolution to match the original clip as well as the frame rate. And we'll go ahead and name this project 4K test just to make it easy to remember. And now, as you can see, if we look below the project, we can actually see the specifications has uh, have updated to 4K at 24 frames per second. This is identical to the original file. That means no rendering is necessary after I drag it in. But now let's say we are done editing and we want to, of course, export this file in 4K. Now, how do we do this? Well, we go over to the share menu and actually select Apple devices 1080p. And from here, if I were to share now, as you can see, it would share this file in HD at 24 frames per second. Let's go ahead and change that. If you go into the settings uh, menu, we can actually change the resolution. And you can see it goes all the way up to 4K, the exact resolution the original clip was uh, shot at. And from here, let's go ahead and hit share. And once your file is uh, done exporting, let's go ahead and go into our iTunes library and under movies and home videos, you will find the exported file. Let's go ahead and drag this to our desktop. Now, if we compare the original imported file uh, to the exported file, you'll notice the dimensions have stayed the exact same. As you can see, this is the dimensions of the exported file. And above that, we have the dimensions of the original file. But now let's go ahead and upload this to YouTube and see if YouTube recognizes this as a 4K file. After having uploaded it to YouTube and uh, playing it back on my computer, as you can see, uh, we have the ability to play this back in 4K. And this will be how you export 4K quality video straight from Final Cut Pro 10. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. We have some more tutorials listed in the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Now I was looking at myself in the reflection. <laughs>